Hello, welcome to this week's betting blog and today I want to touch upon a subject that uh, a few of the older school bookies have uh, reached out to me about and that is the dynamic live betting. Should they offer it and what kind of limits do they uh, give to a player on uh, the dynamic live? The dynamic live and prop builder is uh, fairly new uh, to the North American market. It's been very popular in Europe for years but uh, now that uh, you have a competition like FanDuel and DraftKings offering this product, it is important you offer it, but you do the exact same th thing that they do. They offer very low limits on the Dynamic Live. One, because uh, if he has a $50 wager limit, he could bet that game 10 times where he has $500 on one particular event where his credit limit might only be $500 and his max wager limit since it's only $50, but has made multiple bets on the Save Dynamic Live. So we recommend that uh, if a player has a wager limit of $500 on any game, that his max wager on Dynamic Live is $50. This way he can bet the game multiple times uh, at $50 at multiple different line changes. So it uh, spreads out some of the risk and doesn't uh, let your players, you know, load up on one particular game where he can get uh, crushed and then, you know, unable to pay or has no other credit limit available to continue for the week because he got a little excited and bet multiple times on one event. But in closing, the dynamic is very profitable. We suggest you open it to all your players. You have two different options to use at a company like uh, Real Bookies, Dynamic One, Dynamic Two. Both offer basically the same, just different looking interfaces and a different variety of line types. So by all means, offer it, but keep the wager limits low so that uh, players do not abuse it, especially if they're new to it. You don't want them, you know, um, overextending themselves by betting too much. Thank you for watching and uh, look forward to seeing you on next week's video blog. Thank you for watching the video. Please like and subscribe below and add comments in the comment section if you need any additional information.